decision. That is just unheard of. It's cruel. You need to provide medical attention. So they overrode the default. Learn. They overrode the default uh, settings. Oh, can you? Well, think about it. You're the incident commander. Once the school is deemed safe, you get all the medical help that you can inside the school. Because guess what? We don't know if they're dead or not. Then we find out that within eight minutes of the first shot supposedly being fired, Alex, they're all declared dead. We have 18 children and six school staff members declared legally dead within eight minutes. That's unheard of. And by Connecticut law, only a doctor can declare them legally dead. So who did that? They won't respond to my questions. So, you know, I keep doing this day in and day out. No phone calls, no response. This is Alex Jones for InfoWarsLife.com. The latest in preparedness is now here. An electrically stabilized colloidal silver solution that can be added to both your home cabinet and preparedness pack alike. Concentrated to 30 parts per million in what has been dubbed the Survival Silver Solution. The new InfoWars Life Silver Bullet Colloidal Silver is the answer for you and your family. And it's entirely free of toxic artificial additives that are loaded into many products. The InfoWars Life Silver Bullet Silver is so powerful that it is constantly concentrated into a two ounce bottle and is not recommended for extended continual use. This is not a low grade formula. We are working with one of the top laboratory manufacturers in the United States to bring you the best form of colloidal silver using electrical processes within a base of deionized water. For your preparedness storage or your home kitchen, purchase your bottle of InfoWarsLife.com Silver Bullet Colloidal Silver today and find other amazing supplements at InfoWarsLife.com. A chemical spill contaminating the water supply in nine West Virginia counties. This year alone, over 300,000 people in West Virginia had their drinking water contaminated. What are the health effects of having these drugs in our drinking water? It's forced medical treatment without the consent of residents. My friends, water filtration is one of the most basic actions you can take to protect you and your family from the harmful toxins and heavy metals in your tap water. On average, the county says it sprays with the glyphosate at least once a week. Few filters cut out the glyphosate that is found in water supply worldwide. Remove pesticides, herbicides, chloramines, hydrofluorosilicic acid, sodium hexafluorosilicate. Fluoride it is in tea, it's in coffee, it's in water, it's in bread, it's in toothpaste. It is our responsibility to protect our families. The establishment's not going to do it. It's time to take action. It's time to filter our water. Visit InfoWarsStore.com and use promo code WATER to get 10% off their entire family of incredible products. Or call toll-free 888-253-3139. From the water table, to our soils, to the atmosphere itself, our world is becoming more and more toxic each and every day. But it's not just the air outside that's toxic. Indoor air has been shown to have two to five times higher concentrations of pollutants than even outdoor air. And most Americans spend 90% of their time inside using toxic chemicals within their homes. There are more than 42 million smokers in the United States. Well over a thousand types of mold and mildew linked to numerous conditions. And don't forget the fact that six million Americans live with pets they're allergic to as well. When I began to research these statistics, it was clear to me it was time to start cleansing my lungs in order to combat the toxic environment that we cannot escape but that we can fight back against. Made with organic and wild cultivated herbs and manufactured in the USA, the new InfoWars Life Lung Cleanse is here in a convenient spray bottle that can be brought with you throughout any toxic environment. Now available exclusively at InfoWarsLife.com or by calling toll-free 888-253-3139. Alex Jones here to tell you about how you can help spread liberty worldwide while also enjoying what I have found to be the best tasting 100% organic coffee on the planet. For more than a decade, my favorite coffee has come from the high mountains of southern Mexico where the Chiapas farmers grow their unique shade-grown Arabica beans. We have now managed to secure these sought-after beans in a highly customized blend. Discover and try a bag of the Patriot Blend 100% organic coffee at InfoWarsLife.com. This coffee gives 
gives you a long, smooth pick-me-up for hours without the headaches and heartburn that so many other coffees give me personally. Hands down, this is my favorite coffee. And it's taken us years to secure connections directly to the Chiapas Mexican farmers. Drop by the site today, order a bag or two, and I don't think you're going to be disappointed. Available in original or with our immune support infusion blend. You will be supporting a free press, all the while enjoying a truly great tasting cup of my favorite coffee. Available at InfoWarsLife.com. Coast to coast, direct from Austin. You're listening to the Alex Jones Broadcasting Network. Network. We now take you live to the Central Texas Command Center in the heart of the resistance. You're listening to the Alex Jones Show. We have a nationally recognized school safety and security expert and consultant. He's provided safety training and school assessments for more than 8,000 school districts. He has been the head of one of the biggest school districts in the country's safety. Uh, and I'm not going to just go over all of his credits on uh, Dateline NBC, Good Morning America. A uh, long career as a state police officer in, in Miami, Florida. Uh, if you're just joining us, then in customs. And then he got into being an educator and then security. And he's looking at it and dissecting it like everybody else did. I mean, folks, we've got video of Anderson Cooper with clear blue screen out there. He's not there in the town square. We've got people clearly coming up and, and, and laughing and then doing the fake crying. We've clearly got people where it's actors playing different parts of different people. The building bulldoze, covering up everything. Adam Lanza trying to get guns five times, we're told. Uh, the witnesses, you know, not saying it was him, people out in the woods. But we've got the investigator here, Wolfgang W. Albig. I'm going to give you the floor, sir. Go over your 16 points, the problems, the issues, uh, and uh, break down what you believe is a total hoax. Uh, but but you're the expert. Break it down for us. You know, I've, I've, I mean, I've been doing this. I've traveled the country from one state to another. I've been in school shooting events. I've been there. I get hired as an expert witness after the fact. When I was an assistant principal, yeah, I've seen ch a student shot in our school. And you know what I learned, Alex? When you hear shots fired in your high school, those parents will come at you with every ounce of energy. They are ready to tear down the fence to get to their child. At Sandy Hook, as you said, guess what they're doing? They're going in circle. I didn't see any parents have any sense of urgency to go get their child. And then you read about this guy... There's a guy in the woods. He was supposed to come build gingerbread houses. He's running away from the school, knowing that shots are fired. If I was that father, Alex, I'd be running into the school, not away from the school. It just does not make sense. And then, you know, this is a simple request because I did this at Columbine. You know, Columbine, we had 14 students shot and killed, 23 seriously injured. We had a great teacher by the name of Dave Sanders that was uh, shot and killed trying to save kids. And one thing that I learned about three days, four days later, I saw how they contracted a certified environmental company to come in to clean up all of the biohazards. Alex, there was blood in the media center everywhere, brain matter, skull fragments, the carpet, it was stained with blood. I mean, windows were shot out, broken out. Uh, the police department, you know, they fired over 354 rounds inside the school while kids were still in there. But what I got to see is how they clean up and sanitize and decontaminate. You know, I, nobody will tell me who did that at Sandy Hook. I mean, Sandy Hook had three crime areas, room eight, room 10, and room nine. Yep, they shot out the window, but nobody will tell me who the company is that the Newtown Public Schools contracted with to come in to sanitize and decontaminate. Why is that a secret? It's something that you should be doing by law. Continuing with the 16 points. This is one of my, this is the one that gets my attention. Newtown Police has a lieutenant. And he's working in off-duty detail at a construction site less than two miles from the Sandy Hook uh, Elementary School when he, they hear shots fired. Now, you would assume somebody who's in management, law enforcement management, would automatically break away from his duty and respond to the school. Alex, that man stays at his off-duty job for over four hours, and then he responds. But what people don't know, I read the police report, there was another female officer, and she left 
the duty side to go to the shooting, now why would he not go? I mean, there are just so many questions, and I think they're coming at me, not just one time, because they send another two police officers you know, a couple of weeks later. They want me to stop asking these questions. Why? We're going to find out when we go up to Newtown. But why would a lieutenant not leave his duty? Another one is that Newtown Public Schools, the Sandy Hook Elementary School, Alex, had the highest level of lead paint. They had the highest level of asbestos throughout the school. They had the highest level of PCP, groundwater, inside the school and around the school. And you know what? I've asked for the triannual asbestos inspections, which are required by a school district every three years by a certified outside contractor. They refuse to hand over those inspection reports. The district is required by law, Connecticut law, to let the parents know each school year of any any hazardous materials that reside within the school because we don't want the children to have lifelong you know health uh, sure. issues and, and there's a total cover-up of that and then they've bulldozed the school now they will not release any of the photos any of the transcripts there's clearly a massive cover-up here your best guesstimation uh, of this is what a, a drill which they told the world was a real shooting i mean we know this was their push to get the guns I mean, we know that's the motive. We know they've staged other stuff, but, I mean, I tell you, this is just so bold. Well, I hope at the end of the day that we find the truth about Sandy Hook, and I'm going to tell you what, Anderson Cooper, CNN, and every one of those major networks, well, I'm going to tell you what, they need to apologize to the American people. Because, Alex, I'm telling you, I'm a naturalized U.S. citizen, and I pray to God that I'm wrong. I mean, I, my wife is so mad at me for doing what I'm doing today. I mean, it's almost costing me a marriage. But I'll tell you what, if I am wrong, I'm willing to tear up my naturalization papers because I've embarrassed America. And all those people that believe in me right now, I, can't, I wouldn't want to be an American if I lied to them or accusing America of fraud. We're going to go to Newtown. We're going to get people to raise their right hand. We're going to file class action lawsuits. And the government is not expecting us to do that. But until we get them to raise their right hand, nothing's ever going to happen. We're going to talk about it forever and ever. But we need to go. We need to hold them accountable. And people need to go to jail. I understand. You You see lies. You've got to tell the truth, even though it's hard. And But in the beginning, a patriot's a scarce man. But in the end... Uh, the timid join him because then it costs nothing to be a patriot, as Mark Twain said, to paraphrase. Well, let me leave you with this one. And remember I said, parents, visualize that your child in there. I couldn't believe that within three hours of the first shots fired, with everybody responding, the incident commander is ordering porta potties. I mean, think about this. They're ordering porta potties for Sandy Hook Elementary School. It took me a week to figure it out. I called the porta potty company and uh, I talked to the lady and I said, Who ordered it? When were they ordered? Well, we're not allowed to give out that information. We're directed by the police not to respond to those questions. And let me stop you. What about them bringing the kids back into the crime scene? Absolutely. Why, why would they ever do that? You know, and uh, but the big thing, Alex, here with the porta potty here, we ha there is somebody at the command center that morning who's thinking about porta potties, but he's not ordering the trauma helicopters. He's not letting the paramedics in the. EMT no, it was a PR car carnival. And, and then they're ordering lunch. I mean, you can see the police vehicles who eats lunch. When you have a mass casualty, I would be I would be dead. vomiting and in the bathroom uh, breaking yeah. down and crying. Yeah. Well, at least they got porta potties, so when they're eating their lunch during a massive killing, it just you know what? It just it just angers me, and every American will get angry about this, and they need to. By the way, I've seen car wrecks with dead people where I pulled over to help folks that wrecked, and I did vomit. I couldn't imagine having a six-year-old daughter seeing a bunch of dead five and six-year-olds. I guarantee you, I wouldn't be eating lunch.
globalist social engineers are not just targeting us with propaganda. They are manipulating our genetics. We are being targeted at every level by estrogen mimickers that lower our testosterone and other hormones and natural compounds that the body needs. After consulting top doctors, nutritionists, pharmacists, and others, we have developed what I believe is the ultimate non-GMO organic super male vitality formula sourced from powerful organic herbs and then concentrated for maximum potency. Super male vitality was developed to activate your body's own natural processes instead of using synthetic chemicals. Super male vitality by InfoWars Life is so powerful that I only take half the recommended dose. For a limited time, we are offering 15% off Super Male Vitality at InfoWarsLife.com to introduce you to this powerful supplement. Visit InfoWarsLife.com today to